This must be Bolum. Is that a fire hose or his tongue? <laughs> Whoa! Ack, it's a snack attack, and you're it! Hey guys, my name is JumpSelect, and welcome back to some more Let's Play Super Mario RPG. And in this episode, we're gonna go ahead and continue on. Now, here we have a little, what is it, a funk rat, as they call him. We're gonna go ahead and he's gonna run away. We're gonna go ahead and just kill him now. Put the volume up in my ear so I can hear this better. So, last time we got down to the Carol Sewers, and we're trying to make our way over to Mallow's grandfather. That's where we're trying to go next. And to get there, we have to go to the sewers, of course. Oh, how do, wait, how am I poisoned? I have a poison amulet. What? I'm gonna have to look at that. Do I, do I not have that antidote pin on? That makes no sense. Hold on, I'm gonna check that right now. Um. Oh, that's right, I put the troop. Oh, mm -hmm. Wait, would the antidote pin be But Oh, no, it wouldn't. Okay, never mind. Okay, that's fine. I need to have the true form pin on anyways, but... Alright, so this is where I was trying to get to last time. I went... Ooh. God, I was having a hard time doing it. Actually, I'm gonna try and run away because I know you can jump on these booze heads. If, oh God, if you do it right, I'm gonna try and do it. Okay guys, so the idea is, okay, I think if you jump on this spring, it brings you back to the entrance. I'm not gonna jump on that spring because I think that's exactly what it does. Uh, I believe what we have to do is we have to hit that switch right there because it's gonna drain the water. The water has the well, okay, so the water has been drained. Now what I need to do is I need to get one of these boos over here. And I'm not sure exactly how I'm gonna do it. Like that, okay. Let me see here. Let me try running away now. Run away, please. Thank you. Okay, and if I'm correct, we can get Oh, we almost had it. Okay. Let's just sit right here. There we go. Okay, so we managed to get up here. Now up here we have a mushroom now normally you wouldn't be able to get up here normally now I'm, i think this pipe over to the left wait hold on there's two pipes oh god wait hold on where does this lead oh yeah this is where oh this is where i'm supposed to go because the water drains and so what you do what you have to do is when the water drains you're supposed to come down here and go down this pipe but i just took a shortcut by jumping on the boo's head okay i see now what we need to do is we need to get up here so i need a ghost there we go all right now that we're on his head we're simply gonna jump up here oh i fit i messed it up there we go finally i finally got up here so we got a flower there I'm just, I just want to make sure there's nothing even full going forward. So this is an... Oh, shit. This is an area you're not supposed to get access to yet. But you can get up here if you jump on a ghost's head and then run away. You have a split se a second to, like, jump up there. So you can use a boo's head to get up here, which is kind of weird. But I'm just trying to see if I can do it. Hold on. Okay. Is there anything up here? No. Okay. So there's this pipe here that we can go in and inside this pipe there are some items this is a dead end so it's best to turn back now well if you come here you get a mushroom now this is an area you're not supposed to have access to yet and let's see you can fight this enemy right here but this enemy is way too strong for you to fight right now because you're not supposed to fight this enemy until like later later in the game so we just came up here to get the mushroom and, and to just show it off. Now, there's a safe point right here. I'm probably going to fight a few of these boos off screen. So, I'll just be right back. All right. And do we have any flower points? Let's go ahead and use a flower tab. It's fine. No, let's not do that. Let's use a honey syrup. All right. All right, let's continue. Okay, guys. Here we are going down. I realized that... What is it with these springs? Is that like a way we can leave? Uh, let's see. This must be Bolum. Is that a fire hose or his tongue? <laughs> Whoa! Ack, it's a snack attack, and you're it! And here we have our next boss fight. Now, I believe that he is... I'm gonna try and use... Let's try Fire Orb, and let's see how much damage that does. I always forget, the weak... I always forget weaknesses, but we're gonna try this one out. 
So I was looking up how to do the action command for Mallow, and I just always remember that if you hit Y as soon as the lightning flashes, that it does. It makes like a second thunder noise. I'm gonna try it right now. There! Oh, that's how you do it. Gotcha. Got it. Finally. Room service has been kind to me. Where's my babe? Okay. Also, I'm gonna show off Mallow's new ability that we got, which was called Psychopath. I'm gonna show that off right now. Uh, it's called Psychopath, and it allows him to find out information on this enemy and also see how much health he has. So what you gotta do is you have to press Y as soon as the lions get together. 360 health. Oh, I met. I think I failed. So he has 360 health. Yeah. Health left. Let's go ahead and super jump. Point is, you have to press the Y button as soon as the lights kind of catch up together. All right, we're doing some good damage. Okay, guys, sorry about that. I had an interruption. Let's go ahead and use Psychopath again. I want to get it right this time. I know you have to hit Y as soon as the circles touch. No, I'm, I'm getting. Oh, there it goes. Stick for a body. Head full of straw, give me a scarecrow. Rah, rah, rah. Oh, never mind. Uh, yeah, just. I'm just sucking at doing Mallow's action commands properly. I don't know, it's just been such a long time. The last time I played this game was like. I don't even remember, it was such a long time ago. Uh, Mallow. Uh, what do we have here? Uh, well, we know that he has a little bit of health left, so I'm just gonna do Hammer. That should do some decent damage. Uh, go ahead and use a honey Ooh, no, a honey syrup. We have so many mushrooms and I don't even use them. Honey syrup should do fine. Okay, good. And, oh, can't stand it. The hunger, the hunger, the hunger. No! Okay, Mallow was eaten. Goodbye, Mallow. Goodbye, Mallow. We'll see you later. We're gonna do super jump again just to kill him. And... He should be dead after this. There we go. Oh, I thought he didn't die. What the hell? We should have died from that. And we're just gonna do a uh, jump. Yeah, I'm just waiting for Mallow to come back. Come on, let go of Mallow. There we go. Hey, Mallow. That was scary. I bet it was. If you defeat me, you still won't beat me. Beware the flood. Oh, we got him. Cool. All right, Mallow. How did it feel to be inside a monster's mouth? Yeah. Du -du 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 -du. Okay, so 15 experience, 40 coins. Nice. All right. Bella must have been lying when he said water would come gushing out out of here. Air Mario, do you hear something, or is it just me? Yeah, I can't see the text because of my uh, the way my mic is set up. Water. Here it comes, quick Mario, hit the button before you Whoa, we're washed away! And we're gonna get washed away. Good job, Mal, look what you did. Yeah. I have my mic, ooh, I remember this puzzle, this uh, mini game. I have my mic, my microphone like right in front of my TV. Like, like, like the thingy thing is like blocking like my sight of, of reading. Like I can't see, but that's fine, doesn't matter. This is the Midas River course. Midas, want a crash course on it? Oh no, I'm fine. Now off you go. Now this is a mini game where if you swim up, well, ooh, if you swim around, you can get a bunch of stuff. So here we have frog coins. Now I didn't really go over frog coins yet, but frog coins are pretty cool. Uh, they're a very good way of getting some really cool items later in the game. Uh, you can find frog coins inside chests from enemies. Uh, you can, I don't know, frog coins are just really interesting because you can trade them in for some good stuff from a certain someone later in the game. Um, like I said, it's just been, it's been a while since I've, I wanna get inside there. I can't get inside there. Come on. I can't, whatever. It's been a while since I've um, played this game, so I don't know all the secrets like I used to, but that's fine, cause we'll remember eventually. So let's go inside here. Now let's see. Sometimes you can get cool stuff from these people. Like right now, they're fly they're fighting over a flower. And hopefully we get it. I hope I get that flower. Oh, they're playing around with the flower. I want the flower. Come on, give it to me. Give me the flower, guys. Thank you. Cool. <laughs> they got mad. They're all fighting over the flower, and I got it anyways. 
So yeah, you can go, you can do this over and over again, because like you can go different paths and get like different things. I'm like pressing B to get up, but but it's not working. So whatever, we're not even gonna try. We're just gonna go straight down. Now when you get to the bottom, it's gonna continue, continue going forth. Like I said, this is a mini game. There's a lot of, quite a few of these, quite a few mini games in this game. Actually, no, 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 no. I wanna go the other way. I want to go the other way. No! Game! I want to go the other way. No, there we go. Almost there. There we go. Okay. Alright, let's see. What do we got inside this one? Ooh, ooh that guy's losing coins. Ooh, thanks for the flower, man. Um, Cool. That guy's losing a lot of coins. What a shame from him. Ooh, where are we now? Okay, now we're on this side. Okay, I guess that's really it. Okay, there you go. So you can get some flowers, you can get some fur coins. Uh, now for the barrel jumping event. Need some pointers? No thanks. Now for this one, you, you just wanna make sure that you're on the side that has coins. So what I do is I just, usually I stay on the left side or in this case Mario, or the right side, I guess you could say. Stay on Mario's left. <laughs> Anyways, this is where you can get a bunch of coins. Right now, it would be good to be on the left. So, you kind of have to just, like, decide which side you want to be on. Okay, now, see, this is not the side I want to be on. Because I don't get a lot of coins being on this side. That's pretty cool what you can get. Ooh, coins. Oh, and these. Oh, fish. Watch out for fish. Oh. Okay, we're good. Oh, my God. Let's just make sure we don't get hit by any fish. Oh, no. <laughs> Don't do it, evil fish. More coins. Yay. Oh, God. Ah. Okay. Ugh. Stop trying to ruin my plans. If you get hit by fish, you're going to lose coins. Ah, you jerk. Ugh. No, 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 Mario. Go back to the other side. Damn it. And we fell. Oh, hi. What's that fun? Wasn't that fun? You got 47 coins. Trade the coins you got from my desk for, for frog coins. At the first time, only bonus. I'll give you one frog coin for 60 of your coins. If you didn't know, my frog coins are green coins and tadpole, pond, tadpole ponds got more in, in front of them. You have 47 coins, but that's not enough to cash in, so I'll hold them for you, okay? Come back and try again. Here's something I picked up. You can keep it for good luck. And he gives you a knock knock shell. It is another weapon for Mario, so we're gonna go ahead and put that on because it's a good weapon. It's gonna increase his attack by 10, I believe, so we're gonna go ahead and take it, so cool. Now, I'm actually gonna do the course again because I want to get to more stuff. So we're gonna do it one more time. You can try your luck again if you get on the trampoline. It only costs 30 coins. What, 30 coins to play? Oh my God. No, screw you. All right, maybe next time. Whatever, we're just gonna continue. We'll come back. I'll, I'll come back later. So moving forward, we are now at Tadpole Pond. So here we go. Here we are. This is where we have to go with Mallow. Hi, can I help you? Mallow, it's you. We've heard all about your adventures with Super Mario. You guys beat up Brulem, right? You know about that? See, Mario, the waterways of the world brings news to us here. That's why Grandpa knows all the news that fits to hair. So the news got around very fast. Are you really the Super Mario? Hey, hey everybody, you'll never guess who's here. And look at all the other tadpoles. He's the real thing. But doesn't he look anything... He does, But he doesn't look anything like I thought he would. Hmm. They do say he can jump better than a froggy. I wonder if it's only a rumor. <laughs> and they get all excited. Well, grasshoppers, what's new? And here we have... Grandpa, Mario's been helping me. I know, child. That ransom, that rainstorm we just had, that was you, wasn't it? Yes. Ouch. Watch it up there. You're supposed to make me look like I'm floating here, okay? <laughs> Welcome. So you are Mario, yes? I am Frocrucius. You have come to seek wisdom from me, have you not? I've been waiting for you. Yes, old white people can often give good advice. Oh my god. 
He's about to fall in. But how rude of me. Let's get more comfortable. Come along and we'll talk. Clear, clear full reverse. Okay. Don't just float there. Make yourselves useful. Form a bridge for Mario. And we can jump on the tadpoles. But we're going to go ahead and do that in the next episode. Because we're coming up on my time limit for here. So next time in Super Mario RPG, we're going to continue on and hopefully find out some more information about Mallow. So with that being said, if you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to like, comment, and share. Subscribe to become a gem, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.